I love Quantrix and I want to make you a Quantrix master. Go to QuantrixAuthority.com to learn more. Hey, welcome back to another netcast. I'm Rich Lopez, Quantrix Authority. I think it's fantastic that you join me today for episode number 245, where I'm going to show you how to convert a month name to a number. And this is one method. If you join me for episode 246, I'm going to show you how to do a second method on how to convert a month name to a number in Quantrix Modeler. I have here basic model has a list of years and months and I want to get the month number here. I suppose you could write a case statement. You could also write an if statement, make this happen, or you could simply use a very simple and straightforward formula and simply say that month number is really equal to the month uh, date value of this month that is listed here. And then this is where it gets a little fancy. You're going to throw an ampersand sign in there. You're going to put a, a double quote, then a one, and a double quote again. And somehow, some way, that magically works that Quantrix understands that uh, this date value uh, really can be converted to a month. And you can see that January is month one, February month two, so on and so forth for each one of these months that is listed as text within Quantrix. So go ahead, uh, use month, use a date value, and throw a month in there with an ampersand, uh, double quote, space, one, double quote, close your parentheses out, and you will be able to bring back the month number based off of the month text. I know that I will use that going forward instead of a long drawn, uh, long drawn out case statement. If you have any questions about Quantrix, I hope that you'll reach out to me at QuantrixAuthority at gmail.com. I absolutely love Quantrix. I want to make you a Quantrix master. I hope you'll join me again for another episode of Quantrix Authority with Rich Lopez. I also want to say that if you ever need maybe a longer term engagement, I would really like maybe some help with uh, getting some training with Quantrix or maybe some one-on-one -on -one consulting more in intensive. Also know that I'm available for that and would love to help you become a Quantrix master. That's my goal here at the Quantrix Authority. Today's podcast is brought to you by QuantrixAuthority.com. I love Quantrix and I want to make you a Quantrix master.